It was the year 1999 when I was introduced to the structured way to think creatively. Literal Thinking by Edward Ibano, a very good author, was one of the prominent book displayed at the major bookstores in Bangalore. That was a place where I discovered creative thinking. Most of its material was common sense, but it introduced a complete different way of thinking from the one we have learned in engineering, which was the vertical way of thinking, the vertical thinking. This way of steps thinking using logic was and it still is the fundamental way of business thinking. Consultants and corporate strategists use hypothesis-based analysis to search for problems and solutions. Top management schools use aptitude as a qualifying parameter for selection. Still now, they are using it. And the organizations promote executives who could think and feel just like clones of the top management. Companies have their unique way of thinking, which must be religiously absorbed and used Creativity and innovation are always the buzzword without any concrete actions. You can test your managers with their ability to generate fresh ideas. You will be disappointed always. Ask the meaning of creativity from these people and you will be de-stressed with their amusing answers. Analytical thinking works synergistically with creativity to seek and execute the best solutions. Both are the part of family. One is weaker without the other. For decades, businesses and business leaders are trying for the smooth integration of the creative thinking with business thinking without much success. The reason seems to be the lack of genuine acceptance of its importance in running daily business. It doesn't seem like an immediate necessity, but the life cycle of change is getting shorter. It will be profitable to let genuine innovation and creative solution take one of the seats at the center stage in your business strategy and that will change everything. You should allow fresh ideas to take birth.